Welcome back to our broadcast this morning in the Grants community. This is a very important message to our Grant Project Group and advice to our Grant Project Group. This advice comes as the result of them trying to suspend some of his executive from the group and this advice will go a long way to help them as we wait and expect this money to drop in our account. Thank you for joining Goodness Live of the subscribe as our job is here to uh, update you on the situation and what is going on in the grant community. Thank you for joining us and you pay attention to this uh, great information being sent to all grant pleasure group. Good news live update. Good morning everybody. My name is Joseph. Uh, today is the 30th day of May 2024. I just want to lend my voice to the AGPGN. Yes, I want to lend my voice to them. I want to advise them. You see, all grant pressure group of Nigeria, you guys are great. You are great. You have done great in this nation. You have done what is it Caesar cannot do. In short, the kind of unity and kind of unity and enforcement you have. If the youth of Nigeria can have that unity and enforcement, Nigeria would have been a better country. But you made a mistake. AGPGN, I want to advise and I want to beg you people. It is better you put down your sword. It is better you put your ego and pride aside. Do you know why? You have made a mistake. Yes. Like me, I was once a security personnel. And there's one thing we were trained. We were, we were trained not to fraternize with the people. When I say security personnel, a factory security officer. I was once into it. And we learned something by not fraternizing with the people we are working with. We don't fraternize with people who are not. Do you know why? Because when we fraternize with them, we engage, we have relationship with them, then it will be very easy for them to manipulate us. This is the area where you guys have made a mistake. You see, I remembered this AGPGN started from Kingsley. You guys did not learn. You see, the body called union is a very sensitive body. It is not for weakling. It is not for greedy people. I'm not calling you guys greedy. You see, when you are standing for the masses and you call yourself pressure group, there is a word called pressure. That pressure means putting pressure on the on the grant handler, on the people you are fighting against. That's the meaning of pressure. I'm not trying to tell you your job description. I'm trying to point out your mistake and I want you to believe that you can still make corrections. At this point in time, suspending a member is not what you're supposed to do. It's not the best option. Instead of you guys coming together, agree and brainstorm. You see, it's a very big insult that people are bringing out proof of payment that are carrying the name of AGPGN. Oh, it's an insult. It's an insult. People hearing that you guys have, have stopped, have collected money for your grant, and the grant is not visible just the way you think, is an insult. Putting your name as a signatory to grant, to, as grant handler, to facilit facilitate grant, is also an insult. Or maybe when you started, you weren't really pressure group. Maybe <coughs> when you started, you were just people who just want to help each other. If truly you are pressure group, then having your name as signatory to the grant is an insult. Yes, it's an insult. You have worked hard, yes. You have helped, in short, you delivered us from Telpecom. You delivered us from Golden Bridge. You delivered us from Theophilus. You guys are great. You have done noble. But the mistake you make, having fought the good fight of, of UAG, 
and you have told us times without numbers that Apostle Ken Wakama is the person in charge. You should have handed all documents to him and placed him on condition. This is where you made mistake. Sir, we have seen that you are the one in charge. This is the document. Please take. Now, this is our own provision. You must not do this. If you do this, we'll come after you. If you do this, we'll come after you. If you do this, we'll come after you. If any, Then you guys will give everything to him and place a close monitor on him. This is what you should have done. Place a close monitor on him. On the ground of finance, on the ground of extortion, on the ground of delay. Then you will have a knot of strength to fight. But you guys do not do it. You added your name as signatories. John, uh, John Omolo, what was it called? Pastor Amukbiton. You see, my problem is those two pastors. The Bible said wisdom is profitable to direct. It's an insult to the name of God that the, the pastors are not wise. And let me tell us in grand community, it is not part of the job of a pastor to agitate. Where is it in the Bible? It's only in this grand community. Pastor is not even supposed to be in a pressure group. Yes. The Bible said we wrestle not against flesh and blood, against principalities, against power, against rulers of darkness of this world, against spirit. Your battles are against spirits, not humans. The only way a pastor can agitate is on his pupit. And it's not even agitating, it's lending his opinion. Just like the way Apostle Suleiman, that the Adeboye, all these other men of God are doing on Nigerian politics. You can't see them coming out and carrying placard or coming out and, and forming group. But okay, let's assume we have done it in Grant's community for our own personal interest. For us to have a headway because the majority of those in this Grant are pastors. But the area of not being deep, in-depth in our thinking, Pastor Amukwito, Pastor o -O -O, John Omolo, what was your name? I want the two of you to go and sit down and ask yourself a question. Now, you guys are not even, don't care. Majority of the grant handlers have seen you guys as betrayers. Not because there are evidence of you guys collecting money. No, that is what you think. That is why you are trying to explain yourself. That is why Ustaz Dawood is trying to explain, Jamal Mashin is trying to explain, Pastor Mr. No. This is not the reason why the grant community has lost confidence in you guys. The day your name were added as co-grant handler, that is when you miss it. That is the day the debt of that word pressure group has been removed. You don't, you don't fight a house that you are part of it. Now you guys are demanding for POP. Now, if you guys have not been part of those selling uh, NGO, collecting money for NGO, then you have a lot, a lot of reason to ask for. But you can't ask for POP when you are also involved. On what ground? No, the way you take this, look, the, don't you guys shouldn't go to court too. You will just shoot yourself on the leg. There are so many NGOs that have your proof of payment. So how do you nail Apostle Ken now? It's like, a, uh, it's like you living, it's like, for example, you are a man that has a wife. You have a wife at home, and you don't cheat on her. And they don't ask you why you cheat on her. You don't say that she has stayed for 10 years without giving birth. That is why you decide to go and sleep outside. Is it justified? When what you signed was for, for better, for worse? It's not justified. They will not, they will not show you people who have voted for 30 years, 20 years, without giving birth. You think you can win such a woman when you go to court? You have also dipped your hand into the soup. So how can you prove that your hand is not in the soup when the soup is still smelling on your hand? So AGPGN, I'm not saying you guys have made this. You guys have made a mistake. And correction of this mistake you have made calls for a lot of brokenness and humility. Yes. All these ones you guys are doing, suspending this in between. No. Livingstone did not betray you guys. You guys betrayed yourself. 
suspending Livingstone, suspending this, 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 this. Say you people are the ones trying to, to get foot soldiers that now the camp has become two. We have the UAG camp, we have the AGPGN camp. The UAG camp, the AGPGN, everybody's fighting. Who is suffering? The masses. By God's grace, we are going to get this money. But let us know something. We have suffered together for eight years. And money, money there's a spirit called Mamun. It's the spirit that controls money. You guys should be matured enough. Nobody is less than 18 to know that wherever there is money, there is confusion, there is fighting, there is bloodshed, wherever there is money. My advice to you guys is to calm down. Put an end to all this rancor. Put an end to all this fighting. Go back to the drawing board and ask yourself, where have we gotten it wrong? Do you think all this, you spent two years in Abuja leaving your family Look, no matter, look, good name is better than money. If they pay this money and you guys end up like this, then your stay in Abuja has become a waste. You have to reestate your value. You have to reestate your good name. If there's anything you guys need to do now, is how to come back together, put correction to all your errors, and make sure the masses you are fighting for finally smile. Then afterward, we can bring everything back to the table and begin to correct everybody's mistakes. The Apostle Ken that you people are fighting against kept coming out and saying that he has nothing with you. Obi-Wan Bose has nothing with you. So the way it looks like everybody are looking at you people as immature. Like you're the only people fighting. And then they are calling you people wounded lion. You are fighting because you have failed. No matter how much you explain yourself, nobody is listening to you again. So the best thing now is to see how to help this disbursement to come so that later we can come back to the, to the table and find out the truth. My humble opinion, my humble advice to AGPGM. God bless you all.